Hi, Gail Beskin from BRG Real Estate. We are here in Hawk Valley, which is in K-Bar Ranch. It is a new MI Homes community. This community is entirely made up of villas, attached homes, and this home itself is about 1,800 square feet. Now, we have a nice seller who purchased this home about 14 months ago, and unfortunately his plans have changed. So this house is listed at $305,000. Now, there are some other homes that are new construction as well, but I will show you the differences between this home and those. With everything going on with the coronavirus, our main goal is to make certain that our clients are protected, and so you might not be able to get out and see this home. So we want you to show this, be able to see this, and so we're gonna show it to you virtually. So come on in, I'll give you a virtual open house home tour. Now, this is the foyer, and as you come in, it's a nice open space, you have a spare bedroom to your right, and I will show that to you later on. <laughs> We're gonna do this as we go. As you come in, the garage is over here, and then there's a laundry room, and there is a den off to my right, your left. This den has got French doors. As you come into the graveyard area, and you're gonna to get to see a lot of my backside during this. So, this is a great room area, huge open space. Now, this is what has sold this community and sold this floor plan. This space is overwhelmingly large. It's so nice. Now, it being a two bedroom, two bath with a den, potentially could be a three bedroom, but at the same time, what you're seeing is this huge space behind me. Uh, I would estimate probably 20, 25 by 25 or so. Great room floor plan. Now the kitchen is a granite counter countertop kitchen. This specific floor plan or this specific model, because it was built originally for a, for a uh, buyer, he also put in an upgraded um, uh, kitchen package. So the kitchen package itself has got double ovens, which you don't see too frequently. And I say this frequently myself, I always want to have a Mac Daddy up uh, floor plan that's not as large as some of the big overwhelming homes, but some, a home that's made for somebody who is thinking about maybe downsizing, who would like to have the quality in a home, and this this uh, solves that problem. So, a uh, nice faucet, everybody loves those. Granite countertops, we have a double oven, so if you're hosting or if you're a gourmet, really, really into the cooking, double ovens here. Um, I can pretty much say that these have never ever been used. <laughs> we have a nice GE side-by-side -side refrigerator with just a small amount of food in here. And then the freezer is down below. Now, as I said, this is currently owned by a nice gentleman who has barely lived in it. Um, hasn't spent much time here. Uh, he, he works quite a bit, so uh, the house is barely lived in. So, lots of cabinets in the espresso wood and tall cabinets with the granite, or with the uh, granite, yes, there's granite up above, with the uh, trim up above, which is so important. Also, they're staggered, and this does exhaust out, which you frequently see only over homes, and their homes are uh, 350, 400,000 or above. So nice there, flat top, uh, cooking here. Now, another thing that comes with this package is the pots and pans that uh, this very rarely comes in. And again, it comes with the uh, gourmet packages. And there's two pots and pan drawers there. Um, nice thing also, that this is a large pantry, as opposed to some of the other ones that are very small. This is actually a full door pantry. Lots of shelves, lots of storage here. Up above, we've got can lights. There's can lights, six of them in the kitchen. There's another six that are here in the great room. And, this would actually be where the dining area would be. We used to have this type of floor plan. This dining room table would be up here underneath the light to be used all the time, or as we did, we would put it up over the holidays and then take it back down again and put it in storage to give us additional living space. Now the floors are a tile floor, woodland tile floor. Leans more towards the grays, although you could match tans to go with it as well. The walls are a pale gray, so I'm not sure if that's really visible on the video, but the, wall, the walls are a pale gray. Now, this huge place that comes out here, lots of room for um, larger furniture. Another great part of this home is, number one, the French doors with the side lights. Lots of space here. The French doors were a major upgrade here. And, luckily enough, 
This is one of the few that actually have a lanai that's already been built. There are a few lanais here in the community, but most of them were put on by the buyers who purchased afterwards. And this lanai was installed prior to the time this nice person purchased this home. And so what they also did is put the pavers in. So nice pavers on this, extended lanai. And then when you look out, you see a gorgeous view that will never be built on. That gorgeous view has got um, uh, conservation, lots of trees, very, very nice and relaxing. So when you're out here and uh, relaxing after the end of the day, you have this beautiful area. So back into the house, when we go in here, the master bedroom is in the back of the house, as is typical. Again, very, um, not used very much. Come on into the master. Master's also got a tray ceiling. And there is um, a place for a ceiling fan or light up there. It does have the door to the outside, so you can have access to the outside from the master bedroom. And also there is huge windows over here that you bring a nice light to be able to see that too. Now, master bathroom. Really nice master bathroom. This has got a linen closet here to the right. That's a good size linen closet. And then, just for depth perception, so you can see this, I'm going to go out in the shower. Shower. Huge, huge shower. Doorless shower head. Beautiful Listello trim. And there's two towel racks here. Nice and easy, nice and easy to be kept clean. We've got two sinks over here, and I am going to trade really quickly. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Double sinks, granite countertops, nice drawer in the center, placed for a um, pull-up chair if you wish after that. And then there is a huge closet. It goes from way over here, where you can barely see me, to way over here, where again, you can barely see me. So huge space in here, a little difficult with the camera, but I wanted you to see how big this is. So again, barely lived in, fully updated. Pretty much every update that you could have in this home is included. And again, the access that goes back here to the lanai, which is really nice to have that. So not sure how important that is when you got French doors right over there, but it is nice to have that. And again, there was an extra amount of money that was paid for that uh, option. So let's go back and see the spare bedroom in the den. Again, you're going to see my backside on the way, but not sure if you notice this. Nice little indentation here that would be good for a china cabinet or possibly uh, a big screen TV. Put storage shelves, that type of thing over there. So as you can hear the echo, because little fur furniture here have a whole bunch of space. So coming this way is the den. Now this den, again, as an upgrade, has got French doors. So, nice little French doors here. They go in for privacy. Open them up. Nice size room in here with a big window. Lots of light. And again, as is typical, we've got a great uh, tray ceiling up here. Again, very uh, not, not lived in very much, so we don't have a ceiling fan there, but um, there is a hook up for that. Now, back down the hallway here, we have bedroom number two and a full bath. So for guests, storage type thing. This bedroom has got two windows, two good sized windows and a huge closet as well. That goes from way over here where you can't see me to way over here where you can't see me. So good sized closet, nice carpet, back out to, well, let's go through the door, back out to the bath. And we can do this all in one shot. So we have a bathroom with single uh, sink here and a nice shower door, showers with, again, the same Listello there, good size. Probably, I can pretty much guarantee it's never been used. So there is also a um, medicine cabinet there. So coming back out here into the foyer, or the foyer, <laughs> lots of storage here. One thing I can say about this is there's a good amount of storage in this home. Storage there for all of our outdoor coats, our winter coats, our boots, actually for our vacuums and sweepers. And then this is the laundry room. 
And very conveniently placed, we've got the air conditioning unit, which is a carrier. Taylor Morrison only does the best, so this is a carrier. And again, it's about a year old. Washer and dryer, which do come included with it. And nice storage space up above the washer and dryer. And there is a uh, wash sink, a wash tub here. Again, never been used. So, come into the garage and an open up the cooler. So you can see this. And they have painted the floors. So the floors are uh, well taken care of and it's in a gorgeous neighborhood. So this house again is listed at 305, which is very, very typical of uh, appropriate price for the standard homes that are in this community. Ones that don't have the upgrades, ones that don't have the lanai, the, um, uh, the pavers on the lanai, and uh, the gourmet kitchen and the uh, French doors both on the lanai and also in the uh, den area. So, got lots of uh, upgrades here. Listed at 305, we've got a motivated seller. I would love to show this home to you, so feel free to give me a call at 813-833-9136. We will use all the precautions. We will have gloves. Um, the house has been wiped down since the owner left, and I did have an open house a while ago, so everything's been wiped down, cleaned, and we'll use all the precautions to make sure that you're comfortable. Give me a call or go to galesellsnewtampa.com. Take care.